Priorat is one of the ten Denominaciones de Origen in Catalonia. And along with Rioja, it's one of the two wine growing regions in Spain with, if you like, DO plus status. Its official title is Denominacio de Origen Qualificada, with a Q, which means that, like Rioja, the rules are that little bit stricter and include requirements for all bottled wines to have been bottled in wineries within the region. Each winery has to clearly map out the vineyards that it uses to make its DOQ wines. And there are also tighter controls on quality from one vintage to another. But it's not all rules and regulations. Priorat also has a wonderful winemaking history, which stretches back for centuries to, you've guessed it, the Romans. But our story really begins at the tail end of the 12th century, when Carthusian monks built the famous Scala Dei Monastery, or Stairway to Heaven Monastery, on a site where locals claimed that they saw a ladder which the angels used to go up and down, but to heaven and back. In fact, the name Priorat refers to the lands of the priory, and it was the monks who first planted the vines and built the wineries, which really set the region on the winemaking course it continues to this day. But like many regions in Spain, Philoxera in the 19th century and the civil war in the 20th stymied growth for many decades, and it wasn't until the early 1980s when a far-sighted group of young winemakers led by people like René Barbier or Álvaro Palacios, who saw huge potential in the breathtakingly beautiful landscape of Priorat. Thanks to their vision and efforts, Priorat really helped to kick-start a wider Spanish wine revival, which continues to this day. Priorat can be defined by its mountain viticulture. Like Ribeira Sacra in Galicia, the enchanting mountains, ridges, hillsides and steep slopes, or costeres in the Catalan language, make for a pretty tortuous geography, resisting mechanised farming methods and requiring wine growers to farm really small plots. In fact, the whole DOQ only covers some 2,000 hectares. And those plots give famously low yields. And they're also arranged in vineyards in terraces to facilitate access and in some cases, winemakers are using traditional methods like horse or donkey to till the land between the vines. Another key aspect that sets Priorat apart from other wine growing regions is the famous crumbling black slate and quartz soil known in Catalan as Yicorea. Nutrient poor, the grapes are forced to dig deep for sustenance, and this helps give Priorat wines a distinctive mineral concentration which has become their hallmark. The terraced vineyards of Priorat are between 200 and 650 metres above sea level and only 50 kilometres inland from the Mediterranean. Summers tend to be very hot and very dry, which is ideal for ripening the grapes Garnacha and Samsol, or Cariñena in Spanish. Despite the proximity to the Mediterranean, the local climate can have some continental elements with marked temperature differences between the valleys and higher areas, for example. And in terms of grape varieties, as we've said, it's really old vine garnacha and samso or carignan, which are the stars here. They traditionally produce quite rich, powerful red wines with notes of licorice, tar or black cherries. But as climate change affects wine growers everywhere, Efforts are being made to produce lighter styles with more subtle use of oak ageing, for example. For the traveller, Priorat really is a magical place to explore, and wine enthusiasts have been waxing lyrical over the region's generally quite powerful, full-bodied red wines for many years now. It's also a really good base to explore the new, more locally specific ways of labelling wine, as the Regulatory Council in Priorat has introduced some new categories which allow wineries to label their, ways in a more, label their wines in a more specific, precise way to specify provenance, more akin, if you like, to the system in Burgundy in France. So you'll find new classifications like Bi de Villa or Village Wine or Bigna Classificada, which is a bit like France's Premier Cru label. If you've never tried wines from Priorat, our Kessi wine from the Etant winery is a great place to start. 
It's a traditional blend of garnacha and samso, grown on the traditional Yikarea soils of Priorat. The wine is aged in French oak barrels. It's a rich, velvety, full-bodied red with bags of red and black fruit and a background of enticing Mediterranean herbs like fennel and rosemary with a long, enticing finish.